Chicago Celebrity Summit for the next two weeks. We will be on board. It's our longest cruise ever. It's a beautiful port of Miami. A little different intro to the video because, well, we don't have a room currently because it's being worked on, but that's okay because I'm just so happy to have dropped my stuff. So we're gonna do as we always do, and we're gonna go to the buffet and go check it out and uh, take a look around the ship because she is brand new to us. Guys, I want you to know that I am the godmother of this ship. And do you see the statue they made for me? Look at me, I'm gorgeous. Oh, love her. This solarium spa area is absolutely gorgeous. I love it. Um, were you admiring my statue? Look at my bosom. Oh, I wish my nipples were that high. <laughs> I love her, personally. If I had a solarium, this is what I would pick. Yeah, honestly. It is warm in here. Ooh. Okay, loving this. pasta, a little bit of rice noodles, some chicken breast, a baked potato, and this is just uh, some cheese and butter and lemon for my drink. And then what did you get? Some salad and some antsy pasta. All right guys, so we just finished up lunch. We got incredible gelato, it was amazing. Just purchased the Wi-Fi package, so we're gonna stay connected to you guys this entire cruise, follow us on TikTok. This video will probably be posted after this, but still follow us on TikTok because let's be real, this is not going to be our last cruise, God willing. But now we're gonna go back to the room because we think that it should be ready by now. I'm gonna go check and make sure that the internet is good because your girl's gotta work. And then we'll find some other shenanigans to get into. Any plans? Uh, no, I guess charge our phones. Yeah, that'd be a good idea. None of our devices. We have three phones between the two of us and neither of us have an active working phone right now. So. All right, guys, I got a good nap in, uh, much needed because we got up at 2 a.m. to catch our flight this morning, but uh, I'm done, I'm rested, and I'm ready to go, and so is the ship because it's sail away time. So let's go out to the balcony and let's go say bye to Miami. like that we are saying goodbye to Florida for 20 days we are going to Colombia we are going to uh, help me Costa Rica we are going to Panama Mexico California and then California Mexico again and then we'll finally maybe make it home unless I can convince him to do Alaska we'll see stay tuned so to start, I have some chicken curry, some white rice, and this, I forget what this is called, with mango chut. And then my vitamins. And some liquid IV. Jerry at the stir fry station made me almost pad thai. And it's really good. Like, it was worth the wait. Okay, right, it's just hot. Came out looking. With the little baby corns, aren't they cute? Anyways, this is really, really good. And I highly advise you have Jerry cook you up something. 
He'll pick all your sauces for you. He does it right. We just finished up at the Ocean View Cafe. It was really good. Oh my gosh. One thing that I think is really cool that they offer here is actually um, whiskey tastings. So they have Jack Daniels and then they have McCullen. Uh, what's neat about the Jack Daniels one is it's very reminiscent to a trip that I did in 2019 where I actually went to the Jack Daniels distillery and did a tasting there. And it looks very similar to the setup that they had, which is really cool. But it does look like they have a couple more offerings because I think I only tried three or four. I have to go back and look at the... Uh, the footage but uh pretty neat and so it looks like for the jack daniels it's 45 dollars, and then for the mccullen um it is 60 dollars for that objective of the game is to be the last person standing you're asked a question you have to answer true or false and just hope that you make it to the end so chances are I would not win this game but he's pretty good at these kind of games so, so here is the actual sky lounge menu they have a Libra so I'm definitely gonna have to try the Libra many red candles get their color for boiled Beetles. We both think that it's true. I think they're ground beetles. Oh, yeah, or we'll see. True. The cockatiel beetle bodies are actually they're red beetles. Cockatiel beetle bodies red. Crushed and boiled. And they crush them and boil them to make certain red dyes. All right, we are officially divided. So you, you, you think. This is, you think that Queen has more number one singles than Elton? Because you're on the false yeah. side. Yes. No, okay. I do. How can you know? I do. Fair. I do. I mean, yeah. yeah. I watch the movies, and yeah. Yeah. I do. <laughs> okay. okay, you think, you say it's true. You say Elton does have more than Queen. Okay, I'll let you have the last chance to uh, switch your room. <laughs> We, listen, on our cruises, we have all kinds of anniversaries, <laughs> celebrations, uh, brand new, uh, the brides, we had the audience, we had weddings take place, and every once in a while, we get a divorce. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's see. It's true! Uh -huh. Elton has a grand total of 10 oh. number one UK singles. Good game, good game. <laughs> It's false, he actually only won third <laughs> place. Charlie Chaplin did not even win first place. I it was he no, I actually knew, I right, thought so it was second, but I knew that he didn't, because I thought that was so funny. Yeah. It yeah. Right. But it does see very, very Charlie Chaplin to enter a Charlie question, Chaplin. I'm like, right. I'm like, what would be Vomitorium. Interesting, but they, this is the basketball court. Uh, Brittany's shooting some hoops. You're supposed to have shoes on. She's not. We're just walking around. But we just finished that game. It was actually pretty fun. Uh, we did three rounds. <laughs> we lost every time. And just like that, day one embarkation is over. It is 10.22. We are both exhausted. We've been up since like 2 a.m. We're done. We're tired. We want to take naps. So we are about to get into this luscious bed. I've already eaten my um, turn down chocolate and I'm ready to just snuggle up with those pillows. So uh, tomorrow is a sea day. It's our first sea day, one of many sea days. So we have a lot um, that we wanna try to get packed in for those days. And uh, yeah, we will see you guys in the morning. <laughs> 